On a low drive serve, the one thing that we want to do, and we're not showing the back corner, we'll show that at a later tip, is that you need to get an angle. And it's basically like this is a billiards game where the corner pocket is back in there and I'm kind of like sitting right in the middle of the table and I need to bank it, bank it right here so it comes up into here. The ball lands between myself and the side wall on the floor, hopefully in zone two so it stays off the back wall. So again, I'm gonna make this simple right now, one step. All I'm going to do is drop it, try to drop it as low as I can. We're not trying to get into every detail here. We're trying to get you to start getting oriented to good thoughts. So I'm into here. I'm going to let the ball drop into here, and I'm going to try to hit that thing back into that corner. Just getting that billiards angle. On a low drive serve, you hit it straighter sometimes than you think. When you hit a Z serve, that's when you can hit it crooked. But this one needs to go very straight. Back into here and then it lands in zone two. That one got into zone two. One more time, just get used to this. My racket's up, I come down through. Not too bad, those are pretty good serves. But it gets you getting that angle, the billiards angle back into the corner is so crucial. If you catch a side wall in the air, I have to spend so much time doing this. I'm into here, caught the side wall. I've gotta get out of the way to give the hitting lanes. It is so negative to your progress and your efficiency. So low drive serves straight. Good luck to you. Start putting that into your game.